Hello, everybody. This is Pastor Phil with Full of Life Ministries. Today's message is entitled, The Successful Listener. Now listen, (laughs) when we are at odds with each other or a situation occurs when you have to defend your position or better yet, understanding the need of the person who is expressing themselves, the successful listener responds in the right way because they are mature enough to know what's at stake. Will success, (laughs) right? So guess what? We all have this gift of listening if we choose to use it. (laughs) I hear the laughter because I believe that listening is probably the most important skill in building friendships and relationships. And if we choose not to listen correctly because of wrong motives, you can and will potentially bring harm to a relationship rather than enhancing a relationship by being a good listener. And because we do not listen carefully to the information given to us, we place ourselves in danger of harming ourselves and others. You see, people of God, guess what? Talking is easy, but listening in the right way, well, you get the picture. In the book of James, chapter 1, verses 19 through 21, it tells us, it says, Know this, my dear brothers and sisters, everyone should be quick to listen, slow to speak, and slow to grow angry. This is because an angry person doesn't produce God's righteousness. Therefore, with humility, set aside all moral filth and the growth of wickedness and welcome the word planted deep inside you, the very word that is able to save you. So listen, people of God, with all the relationships we have with each other and our relationships we have outside of work and in our community, let's consider focusing our attention on becoming a great listener. For righteousness is just a simple, a fancy word that simply means God's way of doing things. To do things God's way and you will continue to shine. So today, be encouraged and just keep shining as you are right now. And I'll talk to you real soon. God bless you. Thank you for supporting Full of Life Ministries. God bless.